Now, I don't know if I mentioned I got Farron earlier, but I did get Farron, so yeah. I'm gonna read the note and let's get into it. Hey Thai, what's up? Welcome to VNYL. Hope you are ready to check out some awesome new music. No, check out some awesome new records. I see that you're into the naked and famous, so I'm starting your all wrapped up vibe off with Starfuckers Reptilians. The Naked and Famous is a band that I used to listen to when I was 12. They got me into music, passive me aggressive views, one of my favorite albums of all time basically. It is an album that got me into music when I heard Young Blood for the first time off of the iTunes um, free stuff. I was just totally into it. Um, that's, this is where all the 2011 vibes come in, in like 2013, like that time period of indie pop like totally comes into my package. Um, it is in like, but Passive Me Aggressive You is like the only album I really know by them. <laughs> so I do get the band, the band name mixed up. I do throw an extra the in the name. Like sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. Sometimes I think I always get it wrong when I say, when I don't use the the for some odd reason. I don't know, but yeah, the, that, Starfuckers Reptilians does not remind me of Naked and Famous, but I still enjoyed it. They're more of an Empire of the Sun kind of thing. Like, a very dreary one, though. But I do enjoy it. Reptilians had to be a classic album because there's also a demo version of it out there, and it's a good album. But it is now that I have to listen to Start to Finish. You can't listen to, to it, like, off shuffle. Just, just gonna throw that out there. Also sending you the solid... Indie synth pop record from Generationals. Enjoy Spin On Farron. And there's my order number. Alright, um, like I said, um, Generationals is synth pop. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna refill my ending. Alright, so thank you, Farron. Thank you, VNYL. This is um, an amazing first package. I couldn't be more happier with it, to be honest. I did fill out my profile wrong, so, you know, I'm giving it a 10 out of 10 since. Some things were, well, most of, well, my faults were on my end, so. Was nothing on VNYL's end. Um, if you want to check Generational Ziza, um, do it if you like chilled out music, like I said. Starfuckers, Reptilians, um, you have to listen to it straight through. That's the only thing if you are into, like, Empire of the Sun, you know, Foster People, stuff like that. You know, I highly recommend it. It is a total amazing listen. I wish I listened to it when I was younger or was shown to it when I was younger because it is such a good album to listen to straight through. It is It's a total classic. Like, there is a demo version of it, like, out there. You know, if you do want to check that out, I suggest listening to it straight through. Do not just Spotify shuffle it. If you have free Spotify, you know, go out, go like, go on YouTube and listen to the whole entire thing start to finish if you do not have, you know, paid Spotify. Just gonna throw that out there. And Wild Ones Heat Wave, like I said, I only dislike one song off of it. And I did throw that on my Spotify. <laughs> Because I wanted to hint at v, like you know VNYL, I'm gonna still say that because I did say vinyl earlier in, the, earlier in the video. I did hint at VNYL saying, "Yo, I do like this," and I saw some people get this. You know, I threw in my spot saying, "Hey, you should totally get that for me." <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm, I am glad that I did get that in my first package, and I did get colored vinyl <laughs> too because I'm a total freak for colored vinyl. So <laughs> thank you so much for picking up on that because I did not mention it. Um, Obviously, for my next vibe is Champagne Dreams for the end of my membership, unless I do want to buy another membership. But, yeah, I did get a good first box. <laughs> and I hope my next box is good, too. Obviously, I think I'm, I'm going to be okay if I get, like, black vinyl in it, because I'm like, yo, dude, this is, like, over the top for my colored... I got my colored satisfied, all right? <laughs> but, yeah, I do love... My package so thank you so much um also i do want to throw something else out there if you do want to get ten dollars off and sign up yourself you can instagram dm me at thy underscore kusk and i will give you well you have to dm me your email and i will give you a code but obviously i do want to tell you that um 
Even though VNYL has a cold as ice option for your surprises, they will still send you things that you don't know. I just want to throw that out there because a lot of people like get really angry when they get stuff that they don't know. So yeah, I just want to throw that out there. Like I said, I did get curious. Um, I think I, I did put lukewarm for my next one because I'm like, you know, I do want things that I know and I didn't know and I didn't really know that that was lukewarm. I should read into things, but hey, I did get a good package, so. And I did get something I knew, which was a filler album. They don't men they didn't mention it, so. But anyways, you know, if you get like curious or super fan, obviously ex expect something to not be explained in a note to you. Um, if you get like lukewarm or cold as ice, you should expect things that you might may like. Because cold as ice just means that you want to stick to what you have on your profile. Um, and lukewarm says that you'd like a, one experiment. And then when it comes to um, curious and super fan, you're going to get mostly experiments. And say, hey, you, you like this? Because you like that. And here are two other ones. <laughs> so, and you know, I think super fan may be just like, hey, you're going to get this and that and hopefully you like it. Um, so, I just want to throw that out there. Um, but yeah, if you're cold as ice, you know, you only like this genre and you won't go get away from the artists that you listen to, you're gonna have a bad time with the service. If you're not like that and you have money to actually buy it, then, you know, you should totally get it. It is so worth it, um, if you're open to new music. But yeah, um, if you're gonna complain that, um... You know, Night Tears and Night Choice Sevens, everything's coming up roses. Is, um, cover art is not your style. If you're gonna say, I wanted Room 93, you know, this is not for you. They're not gonna just throw out Room 93 to you. They're gonna throw you some Wild Ones heat wave at you. Um, so I just wanna throw that out there, you know. You have to be open to things. So, yeah. Also, shout out to Eyes on Satellites because I'm wearing their shirt. I forgot that I was wearing their shirt, and I'm just like, yes. This is one of my favorite shirts, by the way. And Eyes on Satellites is a local band from Massachusetts. I think they're from Lowell, like Paris. I could be wrong. Anyways, check them out. <laughs> um, so, yeah, that's about it that I wanted to throw out there before I leave for my, until, like, my next video. So I will see you later. Peace. <laughs>